working. She was right. Come, let us finish this. You know, others said the Giants used to visit the Midgard Mountains before they disappeared. Disappeared? Yeah, I guess they just up and left one day. No one knows why. Perhaps they returned to their home. Teodenheim? Maybe. I wonder if the face in the mountain was a tribute to some important giant. The mouth! We made it! More black breath. Stories of a giant with a deer head. Wonder who he is. Nothing. important to the Giants. It's like they're testing us. Okay, that looks right. What does it say? No yoked beast, nor fearful thrall, nor rooted tree, hath no my call. Hmm. The floor plane. That doesn't mean it. Something's missing. Is it the answer? Freedom. Sure, that works. Go ahead. Sure. Rouse. What you doing? Maybe there'd be a bridge. Huh. Your giants need to test us further. There's a crystal in that torch hole. Should I light it? That helps, right? These passages seem too small for giants. <laughs> Why do you laugh? Uh, you're serious. I am always serious. I forget it. Mom always said you never took an interest in history. Giants are just a race, like elves and hold your phone. This will mean they're big. What of the world serpent? Okay, in that case, giant also means big. There's only one. Great! Another rubbish! <laughs> 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 Whoa! 
Tell me what you see. Well, they look like men, not giants. Correct. Be you seeking treasure? See the traps? Oh yeah. Lucky for us, they set them all off. Be grateful these stay dead. One of the four stags of the world tree. He's supposed to watch the entrance to Yunnan while the giants sleep. Think he's still there? I do not know. in the realms. Think Mom knew this was the Giant's Mountain? No. The request has been more complicated than she could... It's a name, I think. Prasley. It means terror. What's that? Weird. There's a candle all tangled up with string and some sort of animal hide. Some kind of lantern? No wick, though. That is of no use to us. The Bifrost lights our way. Claw reaches the summit. Our goal is near. Right. Atreus, to me! Okay, I'm coming. Well, that's not going anywhere. See how this works. The claws on one side, and if we get this unstuck. Oh, oh no! I think the rope stuck under that rock. That was careless. Yes, sir. Sorry, sir. Find our way up through there. After, you know, getting rid of those things.
mess you created up there, boy. Maybe there's a way up there through that passage, then. We will see. Oh, I was wondering who woke up every Draugr. What is it, Dwarf? There's this alchemist on Gari. Been working out in the Velander mines. You haven't heard from him in maybe, I don't know, a hundred winters or so. Probably dead, but uh, maybe you can find him. He's dwarfing like me. Where's the fancy green ring? Owes me a favor. You look? If it is on our path. Oh, I see how it is. Not a something for nothing type, are you? Fine. If you find Don Vari, I'll make him whip you up something special. This entry stone here ought to get you inside those mines. Let's sort you out. Traps. There's a tunnel, but you won't fit. Take it. Okay. I see that. Let's go! That's it! No way.
can make the rope wheel work now. Why give us the way to the top? Get alchemist for something I'm stewing up for you. If in your smart, you'll find it. Now fuck right along. Wow. How big is this place? It is a mountain. Big. again.
think this goes all the way to the top? We will see soon enough. Something feels strange up there. We're heading into danger. Do not concern yourself with what might be. Focus on what is, and be vigilant. Yes, sir. Not the top, but we're closer. Wait! That one's not broken! There's a note. A giant's prayer. They're asking their ancestors to watch over them. To guide them home. Boy. Wait. I think I know how it works. Watch. them to watch our mother. Do you think they'll watch over us on the way to the top? Come boy, it is a long way up. Whoa! What's Stay it? Stay back! But tunnel boy. These tunnels around the giant's traps. Good thing, too. Well, good for me and. Oh, come on! That is not helping. See you on the other side. Ready up, boy! You sure worry a lot. It serves me well, and how I keep us alive. I guess. Not a terribly fun way to live, though.
hide yourself! Again? Definitely. Oh boy. Yes. Now be ready. mother's ashes what then what comes next nothing comes next we go home that's it the adventure is over for now but we will have much to do you were right earlier on the boat after cutting down the last tree you said it felt like something had changed and it has and our home is no longer safe but it will be again and we must continue your training Okay. We're almost at the summit. Nothing's gonna stop us. Calm yourself, boy, and stay behind me. Yes, sir! Oh. Whoa, what was that? That 
looks like a root of the Yggdrasil tree. Is that its sap? Crystallized sap. There is power inside. Incredible! I can't believe we fought a dragon. I was aiming for his eyes, but I kept losing my footing. Do you think this is their home? Did they move in after the giants left? Or are they why the giants left? Boy, the air grows thin here. No more questions. Oh, yes. I see. Wait, boy. It's Sindri. Can you kill something that big? If we can catch it off balance. I can distract him. What are you doing? We have to help him. Break right. Find an angle. Wait for my mark. Hey, Oakley! Over here! No
plan. Be ready to lower the crane on my mark. How does this thing work? I do not care. Be ready. We did it. And you! Ah! Uh, but, 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 nobody's killed a dragon for hundreds of years. Not since the grand culling of the worms. And unless I'm mistaken, you did all that for me. You are mistaken. The dragon was simply in our path, nothing more. You deny it all you want, but you saved me, and that deserves compensation. What are these? Braided mistletoe arrows, straighter than Heimdall and perfectly weighted. Oh. Uh, thanks? Oh. Okay. Hold on. Uh, ooh, not that. Um, have you seen my brother again? Yeah. He said you lost your talent. <laughs> oh, and that I'm selfish. No. I'm sure. That I value a weapon's look. No. Over its purpose. That I'm pretentious. No. And uptight. Fussy! I know what he thinks, but he can't hurt me any- Ah! Burn that. I do not have time for this. No, 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 wait, 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 wait! I have a better idea. What? I just need a tooth from that dragon. Watch where you grab that. Oh, ah, never mind. Oh, so unclean. Oh, so, so unclean. Oh, oh, the smell. Perfect. That should do. Oh. Yeah. I am not touching that. Just hold it out. Now, run that along the string of your son's bow. Just humor me. Atreus, your bow. Two passes should do it. Ah, gently, now. Whoa! Oh, sure. Now you're impressed. Um... Oh, I see. Figured it out on your own, then. Just... never mind. 
I wasn't just explaining the beautiful and complex artistry of my craft or anything. No, just anything to help you. Yep. I say so. Myself. Anything you need, young sir. Be seeing ya. Feels like it wasn't that long ago we were hunting deer. Now we fought dark elves, trolls, and ogres, and a dragon. I feel like we could be anything now. We win because we are determined, disciplined, not because we feel ourselves superior. Sure, I know. It's just, it feels good to be strong, you know? Yes, I know. <laughs> This one's called Emir. 
Mother tried to tell me this one, but I think I was too young. Are giants coming out of his armpits? I think that might be Odin stabbing him. I will never get tired of shattering things with this. Long now, Mom. Look, the summit. We're so close now. Your quiver. Strap broke when we fought the dragon. It's all right. I can hold it. Stop. Quiver will slow your draw. Pain we endure. Faulty weaponry we do not. This will do for now. Good? Good. Hmm. Go. Steady, boy. Mind your footing. voices too, right? Yes. Be silent. Sorry. Such is such it. You know why we're here. My last visit managed to loosen your tongue. That sounds like the same man who came to our house. You said you killed him. Shh. Not company this time. It must be important if the sons of Thor deign to grace me with their presence. Tell me, you two still tripping over yourselves to impress Daddy? The tattooed man. Tracks show he now travels with a child. Where would they go next? Why would I know that? You're the smartest man alive, aren't you? Smarter than all the dead ones, too. You help me, I help you. Tell me where they are, and I'll talk to Odin. Your father won't let me go, Baldur, and he won't let you kill me. You have nothing to offer me, so take your questions, take your threats, take these two worthless wankers, and... Piss off! When no one's looking, we'll be back for your other eye. Don't you forget it. We're everywhere. We really are, aren't we? Ah, the very topic of conversation. 
A tattooed man traveling with a child. Boy took their path. Make sure we're all alone. But we just saw them leave. Do as I say. He doesn't know what you are. And I would keep it that way. Who are you? Me? I'm the greatest ambassador to the gods, the giants, and all the creatures of the Nine Realms. I know every corner of these lands, every language spoken, every war waged, every deal struck. They call me Mimir, smartest man alive. And I have the answer to your every question. Why does the son of Odin hunt us? Okay, there are a few gaps in my knowledge. But Odin's had me imprisoned here for 109 winters. I'm a clever lad. I can piece it together. I promise. Just given time. Nobody there, just like I said. The boy's mother is dead. She wished her. She wanted us to spread her ashes on the highest peak in all the realms. Oh, then you've come to the wrong place, little brother. The highest peak in all the realms is not here in Midgard. It's in Jotunheim, realm of the giants. No! I could not be what she meant. Take a look. This is the last known bridge to Jotunheim in all the realms. See that mountain? Looks like a giant's finger scraping the sky. That's the highest peak in all the realms. No here. Can we just take that bridge? We have a Bifrost. When the giants destroyed all other bridges to their realm, they locked this one up with a secret rune. If it still exists, only a giant would know it. And all of them left Midgard a long time ago. True. But today, the winds of fate have kicked up a strange vortex of coincidence. Fact is, there's only one person alive who can get you where you need to go. And luckily for you, my schedule's wide open. We're going to Jodenheim, right? It's your best and only move from a tactical standpoint. It's the one place the man who cannot be killed won't follow you. What do we do? Yes! First, you need to cut off my head. Wait, what? And Odin made sure that no weapon, not even Thor's hammer, could free my body for these bonds. But fortunately, you don't need my body. The trick is, we need to find someone who can reanimate my head using the old magic. Old oh, magic? Mm. There's a witch of the woods. She knows the old ways. And she'll help. She might do worth a try. But if she fails, he will be dead. He tortures me, you know. Every day, brother. Odin himself sees to it personally, and believe me, there is no end to his creativity. Every single day. This... This isn't living. Very well. Oh, I can't watch this. Brother. In case you can't resurrect me, there's something you need to know. The boy. The longer you wait to tell him his true nature, the more damage you do. He will resent you, and you may lose him forever. There is much about me I would not have him know. Huh? So you value your privacy more than your son? I'm going to cut off your head now. Fair enough. realm of the giants that's that's inconvenient yeah that's just what i was going to say another cypher piece i'll see what i can fit together do you remember the way to the witch's house Yes. The woods with the blood red leaves. South of the lake. I know just where to go. Hope she made it back from Alfheim and can bring the mirror back. You seem nice. Before you cut off his head.
Look at this place. This must be a branch of the world tree. Boy, stay on the path. Right, right, I know. I can't believe it was Balder that came to our house. The Acer, though. Balder. And you fought him. And won. Yes. One of Odin's sons, Thor's brother. Now he's hunting us with a left Why is this happening? If we can raise the head, you can ask him. Father? Now is not the time for that. Yes, sir. Hear me screeching at you whenever you're twiddling your short and curlies. Leave him, boy. No, Fab. Well, you already soiled my solitude, so you may as well join me. You're not hungry. Good. It's not what I was offering. Saw your brother again. Congratulations. And I'm sure you'll let him go and roger my axe good and plenty again, hmm? Let's see the damage. Mm, little canker throat wouldn't know proper weight and balance if it were dangling off his chut. Mm. Is he eating well enough? I guess. Good. All better. Now what the fuck else you want, huh? Times he gets so wrapped up in his work, Sentry has it the sense to sip us up. And if he does remember, good luck getting him to cook his own meat. Guess I got all the stomach in the family. <laughs> You're along with the smarts. You miss him. What, that spit fister? What do you know? I just mean hey, that- Hey, do you mind? Trying to concentrate here, already on a break from my break. Boy, what is the path back to the witch? First we need to find a boat. Do you remember the way back to the witch from here? That way, behind the big statue of Thor. I wish we could have gone on a trip like this with Mother. She could fight, couldn't she? Yes, she fought beautifully. Any good stories to pass the time? What kind of story? I don't know. Mother always had stories. Weren't you told me when you were a boy? There was a man I knew of long ago. His stories were brief and purposeful. Sounds fun. Do you remember any? <laughs> there was one that concerned a hare and a tortoise. Like the witch's house? Unlikely. So what happens? They wager on a race between them. The hare is too confident of victory and foolish, while the tortoise is steady and disciplined. The tortoise wins. 
You haven't told a lot of stories, have you? Huh? The water dropped. And the serpent rose. Right. I knew it. I know she's really powerful, but you really think the witch can bring a head back to life? She seems competent in her craft. And we have nothing to lose. If she can't bring it back to life, can we keep the head? No. But you may feed it to the fish. Okay. And now the door's gone. The witch's turtle must be standing up. So how do we get back up there? I bet this will lead out. Turn back, Ace. Guess the gods are welcome here. <gasps> there he is. I hope he remembers us. How's it going, Charlie? Is your witch friend here? What is that name? That's what he told me it was. Or what it sounded like in my head, anyway. Charlie. Focus up! Hello. Oh, can you bring a head back to life? Uh, I'm not sure I understand what... Wait, where did you get those? The arrows. Give them to me, now. They were a gift. Do as she says, boy. These arrows are dangerous. They're wicked. You find any more, you destroy them, understand? Do you understand? Say it! I understand. If I see them, I'll destroy them. It's all I ask. Forgive me. Please, take my arrows in their place. I have no need for them anymore. <sighs> now, what's this about a head? <sighs> Hello. 
Do you have any idea who this is? Did you kill him? At his request. He claimed you could revive him. Me? Are you sure you heard him right? Please? <sighs> Take him to the table. Hey, Mille. It's been a long time since I've practiced the old magic. Hold him there. Let's have a look. Well, thankfully his head hasn't decayed much and his brain is still intact. <sighs> nice clean cut. Cutting off his head of all people. I sure hope you know what you're doing. Now, hold his head under the water and don't let go. I mean it. That's enough. Let me see him. Mamir, you there? Yes. Good. Oh. Hello, Freya. Been a long time. You look well. What I did, I did for them. As far as I'm concerned, death suits you better. I'd bow if I could, Your Majesty. Forgive me. <sighs> Had I known the witch in the woods was Freya herself, I never would have suggested this. Freya? The goddess Freya? You didn't know either. Sorry. When word gets out that Mimir is free, the wrath of Odin won't be far behind. You are god. Leader of the Vanir once, yes. But no longer. You did not think it important to tell me. Are you really going to lecture me about that? We are leaving, boy. But... Now. You're welcome. Why did you do that? We cannot trust her. Because she's a god? Have I taught you nothing, boy? But she's helped us a lot. She lied. Some people value their privacy. Best not to judge, brother. When I require your counsel, Head, I will ask. Fair enough. Get me to Tyr's temple in the Lake of the Nine, and I'll get you to Jotunheim as promised. We know the temple. What's there? Only the last living giant in Midgard. Who better to tell us the way? World Serpent? Wait, do you know how to talk to him? Indeed. He speaks an obscure tongue more ancient even than these mountains. None are left in Midgard who speak it. Except, of course, for me. You do? It's true. You wouldn't know it to look at him, but Jormungandr is a sparkling conversationalist. So, Mimir, why did Freya spit in your face? No. Speak of Baldur. He claims nothing harms him. Aye. Baldur is blessed with invulnerability to all threats, physical or magical. Boasting of a god. Everyone has a weakness. Not him, I'm afraid. Baldur is blessed with invulnerability to all threats, physical or magical. You just said that, Mimir. Did I? What is the source of this power? Well, as I recall, it involved, uh... A spell? Mamir? Parts of my brain must still be coming back to life. Just need a moment to finish waking up. I hope he's not broken. Hey, how do we speak to the serpent? There's a horn on a platform at the middle point of the bridge. Take me to it. 
Finally! That horn!